Hey, how's it going, guys? Oh, welcome to One Shot. This game was gifted to me by Volunteer from YouTube, Twitch, and my Discord. <laughs> mm, I meant I've been wanting to play this game for a long time, so here I am. Here we go. Take it up, beloved friend Felix. Oh, it's it. Oh. Okay, let's see. Oh, it has um, Xbox controller options here. Select. Oh, examine is eight. Okay. B, walk, right trigger to run. Oh, to walk faster. What's that one? Oh, let's start. Okay. Cool. Explore to act with the environment and characters. Sometimes you may find an item. Once you have picked up an item, you may select it from your inventory. When the item is active, you can either combine it with the other item in the inventory or use it as a or use it in certain location in order to progress. Although full screen is an option, the game is best experienced in windowed mode. Closing the game will save your progress. This game also autosaves after some key events. Okay, the game autosaves. Cool. Oh, hello? There's a TV remote here. Nico, pick us up. Oh, I don't know a password. Dusty books, it's too far. Okay. A soft glow lights through the window. Ah, oh, man, I thought I turned that off. My reflection! A pair of luminous yellow eyes stares back at Nico. A weird plant sits here, stiff. Stiff drying. What? What's the... A brine snaps off. A withered plant sit. Why is it weird? No, I guess it's the item that's uh, a little darker. There's no need to do anything else to it. There's no water in the toilet. The top one run. The door is locked. Oh, I still don't know the password. Um. Oh, it can't be combined. Dry branch from the bathroom plant. Hmm, maybe put in the water. So I need to escape from this. The top won't run. Huh. Dry branch. This is gonna be a hard first episode. <laughs> I don't know the password. I have a remote. But I can't seem to interact with anything with it. What? 8912. Oh. Oh. <laughs> wow. Okay, so it's like this. 9812. What? Shit, it's different colors. Blue, green, red, yellow. Blue, green, red, yellow. So eight two nine one. Eight two nine one. Cha ching! I'm a smart boy. Okay, you found me. Why? You're already too. You're already too late. Not much of the world remains. This will 
be apparent once you go outside. This place was never worth saving. Or do you still want to try? Then remember this. Your actions here will affect Nico. Your mission is to say is to help Nico leave. And most importantly, you only have one shot, Scott. <laughs> wow. <laughs> it just it did a, it just did a pop-up thing. Uh you can't see it. I'm gonna go back in quickly. And then I click OK. You know, so I only have one chance to do this. So it's one of those games. Hello? Anyone? The TV gives us a dangerous looking spark. Perhaps it could be lit. Then we need to find a lighter. The sink won't turn on. Ooh, bottle of alcohol. Just a table. Hmm. Stick? No. Oh! I gotcha. You can do Yeah. Okay, I got it, I got it. Yeah, boy! What's this? Something glimmers in the firelight. It appears a small metallic optic wedged into the crack of the floor. Nico dicks it out. What'd I get? A basement key. Sweet! It's this one, right? It looks like a keyhole. No. Okay, it's in the next door. This game's spooky. <laughs> sure, it's getting spooky. Oh, light bulb. Give it to me, baby. So it was. It's the sun. Yay! I got the sun, guys! Nico's cute. <laughs> I like him. Do I need to insert it in here? Ah! There we go. Did I save the world? Ah, uh, bring it with me. Where am I? You can quickly travel to the location you have already visited by selecting the fast travel option in the menu. The default key is for opening the menu is A. Fast travel cannot be used indoors. So I came from tire tracks. Also, the background picture I got here, I found it. That's from Twitch's game list. So I assume that's like official art. <laughs> What's left of a robot? Did I just come from here? Yeah, I did. Okay. A robot no longer has power. Mine space? What's left of a robot? Oh! Oh, okay. Transition. Okay, that's cool. I thought I did something wrong. Well, let's explore this area some more. Oh! Ah! Ah! That light bulb. You are here. Me? Yes. Welcome to our world, friend. I am most humbled by your presence, yes? Uh, thanks. Sorry. I'm a little lost. Ah, right. Allow me to explain some things. 
May I first ask how you arrived here? I'm not sure. I woke up in this weird house. It was really dark. Oh. So you woke up in an unfamiliar, unfamiliar dark location. Hmm. Just as my prophecy foretold, yes? You are the savior we have been waiting for. You will be the one to save our world from eternal darkness. Um, I will now provide you with vital information. Please ask me anything. Ah, uh, well, can you tell me about this world? I'm not sure where I am exactly. I can't see too far off. Everything's so dark. Our world has not always been dim. Nor was it so random, broken. But this waits for nobody. But time waits for nobody, not even saviors. The world is divided into three regions. You're on the fridge right now, the barons. The tower you see in the distance once hold our sun. Oh, so that's where the tall thing was. As you go further towards the center, you will cross the other regions. There should be a map still in this outpost somewhere. Oh, can you tell me about the light bulb? I found this in the house I woke up in. Within your hand is our new sun. Your sun? Yes. Years ago, our previous sun sat atop that tower and spilled its life onto the land. But one day, the light went out. Oh. The world is still hanging on by a thread. The surface of this world is abundant with an element called phosphor. Unfortunately for us, this, this element stored light energy from our previous sun. It's now, it's now our only source of illumination, but its energy is finite. When the last of the light dies, our world will too. Ah, but now that you are here with the new sun, all is well. You will need to restore it to the tower. That looks pretty far off. Yes, so begins your pilgrimage. Also, the sun is fragile, so be careful. If the sun shatters, the world will end in an instant. Oh. Can you tell me about the computer? In the house I found this computer. It kept saying stuff like, your actions will affect Nico. But I'm Nico. And those messages went are those messages meant for someone else? Hmm. If I had to guess, they might be trying to pass the message to Scott. Ah, that would be our god. If you are here, that means Scott is here also. Scott will provide guidance for your journey. In fact, they already have. Really? I haven't seen anyone though. Have you not contacted Scott yet? I don't think so. Being the bringer of our son, you have the sacred ability to communicate directly with Scott. An ability that no one else possesses, certainly not I. Please come, please close your eyes and focus. All right. Hello? Scott, are you there? I'm here, hello. <laughs> yes. Oh, th th nice to meet you. My name is Nico, I know. That's neat. I actually heard someone. They said their name is Scott. This is incredible. Do not be afraid to ask God for assistance. You are the, my you are the messiah after all. Can you tell me about getting going home? Oh, I don't mean to be rude, but I, I'm not sure about this. I still don't know how I got here. I was just on my, just with my mama a few hours ago, and now it feels like I'm in a bad dream. I just want to go home. Your mission is to save our world, just as my mission is to tell you about our world. And I'm able to help you beyond your pro my programming. I am sorry. Oh. I think that's all I have to ask for now. Excellent. I wish you good luck. So he said there's a map somewhere in this outpost. It won't turn on. Maybe that's something. This box looks interesting. I wish I had something to pry it open with. Self-charging solar battery in N87. One year warranty included. Simply place your self-charging battery in full daylight in the lens facing up. Charging in seconds, no external power is needed. If the battery fails to charge, check to see if the lens on the front side has not been dislodged during transport. One charge cycle would last about 10 days. If you notice a, a decline in the charge cycle within a warranty period, please contact the manufacturer. Okay, I need to open it with something. One, a robot may not injure a living person. Through inaction, allow a person to come to harm. A, a robot must obey given the orders given to it by people, except where such orders would conflict with the first law. A robot must protect its own existence as long as such protection does not conflict with the first or second law. With the robotics law. Ah, oh, here's the map. We're we're in boxes, right? Can I take it? Oh, okay. I need something to pry that thing open with. The use of robot as our the use of robot as our replacement head engineer seems unorthodox, especially the one responsible for last year's incident. I suppose they had to get her away from the from the city, but that doesn't make it easier to swallow to swallow for those of us who work here. 
I hope that man knows what he's doing, management. It's a faded poster. The rarest form of blue phosphor is found during the phosphor shrimp spawn period. If you observe a pond with a bubbled over surface, please contact management with the special harvest team immediately. Five new positions available at the mines. Housing and other provisions are included upon hiring. First come, first serve. Let's go further in. It's a shiny. A page with faded ink. Able to provide power to all robots and machinery in this area via a large electromagnetic field. Electromagnetic field. Maintenance efforts are quite high as expected. We have provided customized backup cells for the new most important robots. Their electromagnetic, <laughs> electromagnetic fields are much weaker, and the signals are highly specific. In other words, these small cells can only charge one single... Hmm. Can I take them? Oh, electromagnetic. Magnetic. It's a big machine. It doesn't seem to be doing anything, though. It's a rectangular shaped hole in the middle. Dusty shells. So I guess I need to come back here to pry it open. But I, s I saw the map. To tower in the middle. We're in... Okay. We'll have nothing to pry it open with at the moment. So I'll probably come back to that place. So any robot here does just doesn't have any power. Pressure bars could crush metal. Probably need it for something. Oh, this one is still working. <laughs> okay, so I'll probably need something to crush in there. So I'll probably need to go back here for that. Music's nice. So this is like the robot factory, so I know that's there. That's a good thing there's a fast travel, right? Ooh, shiny. train tracks. Oh, paper. Although the poisonous gas is highly localized in the vent zones, barren workers were still recommended to wear gas masks. These masks were mandatory around active vent sites, of course. As more and more of the workers got replaced by robots, we found ourselves with a surplus of abandoned gas masks. It seems like a waste to get rid of them all, so we kept a few for emergencies. Okay, so some, I need to find some gas masks too. Oh, 
computer. The sun will not return to the ab abyss where it's calling my and the abyss is calling my name. I'm sorry, Ron. We're choosing to leave before the darkness suffocates us all. A metal safe. It seems like it's locked with a six-digit code. I don't remember seeing any six-digit codes. Do you? No, I don't. That wasn't it. That's probably where the gas masks are. With the mining operation going smoothly, materials are no longer our limiting factor. We will be able to build more resilient robots, both in body and mind. Specifically, the discovery of metal alloy 291 will likely allow the development of highly efficient circuitry. Oh! Going more left. I mean right. Is that a battle here? A robot. Just like the rest. I think I'm going too far. Exploring! Whoa! The light bulb! Is this a human? So, are you the messiah? That's what I've been told. I expected someone taller. Or at least someone that doesn't look like a kitten. That's what you are, right? Some sort of cat? Nuh-uh. I'm a person. You got the eyes of a cat. But cats walk on four legs. Well, either way. A child like you being the messiah just doesn't feel right. But the robot back there says there's no mistake. I know. <sighs> this is going to sound cold, but I honestly think you're better off just leaving and letting the world die naturally. The world seems to be, has been falling apart for a long time. This man of decay is highly un, unprobable. That the sun can fix it. You've already seen how bad it can get, right? We haven't seen much of anything, actually. And we can actually... And we can't really just leave. Oh, so you just got here. Then you must be headed towards the tower. Mm-hmm. That's where I'm supposed to put the light bulb. Uh, the sun, isn't it? Yes, at the very top. You know that the tower contains a force that nobody could comprehend. And that power is strongest at the summit. Maybe it will send you back home after you complete your mission. Oh! Don't take my word for it, though. Dear Silver, I heard the news about the mines. I'm sorry. I can't imagine what you're feeling. It's been two weeks. I know it must be hard, but maybe it's better that you came back. It's only a matter of time before the robots... The robots are recalled. At least you let me know you got my message, okay, Kip? Do not touch that. Oh. Sorry. I got curious. What is that thing? Oh, did I lose internet? Damn. A backup power cell. It keeps me functional. The main generator for the Barons ran out of power some time ago. It could not even last a week without the sun. Sorry to hear that. All we can do is make use of the light we have. Something's poking out from the shelf. Oh, it's a screwdriver. You can take it if you want. It may help you. Are you sure? Yes, I have many. Thank you. Lots of tiny shrimp are swimming in this jar. What's inside this tower? I don't know. Nobody's ever entered it before. At least nobody's, nobody history knows. That, who built it? Built? As far as anyone can tell, it's been there since the beginning of time. I know someone who wanted to study it before, but... Oh. He never told me if it went anywhere. So I got a screwdriver, make it pry it open. I haven't played chess with anyone else for a very long time. Oh? Not even with the other robots? No. Nobody in the Barons have the capacity to in their programming. Nobody here is tamed, for that matter. It's a crate. A bed. Doesn't look very comfortable. We're good, thanks. She's not gonna question why I said we. Or why Nico said we. It's fun of two people. The glass is a bit too far, I can see details though. Okay, I got a screwdriver, so maybe I can pry that thing open now. It's a Phillips head, but it's, it's still something, right? Uh, 
Oh, I got that one. Wait! <laughs> uh, I'll post. It's a good thing this fast travel. I forgot about that. Ah! Okay, I tried at least. Okay. Keep trying. Look up point. Okay, let's keep moving. What's this? Wait! I saw you heading towards this direction. The mines has been abandoned for a long time. I cannot guarantee that it's safe. If you must enter it, it is my duty to accompany you at least much. At least once. Oh, thanks. There's a little gadget on the ground. It looks kind of like a camera. What's left of a camera anyway? Probably was even part of a robot at one point. Oh! I, or not, I don't know. Get it anyway. Oh! Okay. Done! Lens! <gasps> we need that! Goody goody. Do be careful in there. Don't mind me. I can see a faintly, faint yellow glow in the distance. Don't stand so close to the edge. Oh, sorry. Looks looks like even the entrance tunnel collapsed off. Without a vehicle, we can't proceed. Can't we walk? I can, but for you, it's safety violation. I won't allow it. Allow it. What's ahead anyway? I'm gonna put my control up here. So I think that, I can think I'm gonna make this like a long episode. It's a huge network of underground mines. The source of this world metal are non phosphor fuel. This is what propelled the world into industrial age. So now it's lost power. It's been for a while now. When the sun went out, the mines were first to be abandoned amidst the initial panic. Even the robots has been all cleared out and repurposed. That makes sense. Though there was one that always insisted on going back. Oh! I hope he's okay. So we need a minecart. Well, we need a vehicle. Ready to leave? Hmm. Oh, okay. So she won't allow me to walk there, so we need to have some kind of minecart there. So I got a lens. Which we're gonna use. God, there's something in the air here. It hurts to breathe. Yeah, this is the. We need the gas mask here. Okay, so I think. I guess I have explored everything here. Yeah, it seems I have. So. Fast travel back to the outpost. Entrance. Okay, I'm back here. Okay, okay, okay. So I'm gonna try to go up from here. Oh shit! This is a good transition. See green glow in the distance. Oh, a fisherman or a boatman. What's up, dude? Um, hello. Scott, are you there? Yes. Oh, good. There's a robot here attached to a boat. It doesn't seem to have power, and its joints are rust all over a uh, swell. But I think we should be able to fix it. After all, we'll need to cross this ocean to get to the tower. So it's rusted, so... Oil? What, what What do you think he will say, like, if I said no? Then I actually did hear him. Ah, oh, bed! A metal pipe! Must have broken off of one of those terminals. Sweet. Hmm, maybe I can use that to pry that box open. 
Sure. Oh, what? <laughs> so this is how you close the game? I guess this is a good point, a good spot to like stop the recording for a bit. <laughs> okay, so that was part one. Hope you enjoyed and look forward to the next part. I'm going to leave you guys with a high five.